All right, here we go. How are you doing, everybody? I'm Nathan Brooks, sales representative with Sutton Group Select Realty. It is April 16th. I'm going to try something new. We've got a new listing coming up. And I thought, why not try and do a little virtual tour? I've got a gorgeous 3D tour here, but with, uh, with the power of technology, why not just turn this into a, a quick little introduction video? So here goes, we'll give it a shot, first time ever. But uh, this property is actually in the west end of town, right here in London at 681 Amberley Avenue in the heart of Oak Ridge Acres. So uh, people who think about Oak Ridge Acres, quite often they're thinking about an awesome place to set the roots uh, for a young family. This, as you can see, is no different. We're situated on an, a lot. It's 80 by 180, one of the quieter streets in the neighborhood. This home has had extensive work done to it. You can tell right away the exterior does not look like your traditional uh, Oak Ridge Ranch. All of that original brick has been removed. Spray foam insulation around the exterior has been applied. Uh, we've got a nice new builder stone on the front with the brick all the way around. So really, really nice curb appeal. You can see tons of mature trees. Now, what is different about this home is on the inside. You've got a three plus one, but the plus one gives you options. There's actually a separate entrance through the garage. So if you're thinking uh, multi-generation families, uh, teenage retreat, or maybe even you want to do an own owner occupy, there is an income opportunity here for you as well. So um, without any further ado, you know what, here, I'll just click on this real quick. That is a, an opportunity to see just the side door. So you enter through the garage down into that lower level. So without further ado, let's take a quick look on site. I'm gonna switch this around, main floor, and should drop us right into the foyer. Spin this around. When I talked about work that's been done, you'll see. 2012, 2013 was a, was a big year for, for this home. They've contracted everything out. They've done things the right way. Permits were applied. They are now closed. So they eliminated a beam in here. They carried that weight right down into the footings, had those reinforced in the lower level. So that's all good. But what you have is a nice open concept between your dining, kitchen, and living room. Gorgeous hardwood flooring, tile in the kitchen, the wet areas. I'm going to slide over here into the kitchen. You see a nice glass backsplash, granite counters, stainless appliances. Now, make note here, guys, as well, these are not your typical uh, particle board cabinets. They are solid wood, and they're all finger joint grooves as well. Really, really nice home. Let's just take a quick rip down the hallway. Like I said, we do have three bedrooms on the main. We've got a four-piece bath as well. I might as well click on that real quick. You can see tiled surround for your tub. Bringing it back around. Earth tone colors, pedestal sink. Quick glimpse of the master. All of the windows have been replaced. So you've got all newer windows again, back 2012, 2013. Hardwood throughout. Really, really nice. Let's go downstairs. I know we're moving pretty quick, but again, this is just an intro. Yeah, if you want more, more, um, more um, information, not a problem. Just ask, I can send you this link. It'll be all over the place, not a problem. I'm gonna change this view. There's your staircase, guys. Come through the garage down in the lower level, drops you right into this rec room. And you'll see this rec room has also been opened up quite nicely. I'm standing right now on this view where there was uh, another telescopic post once, once upon a time, also removed. So if somebody wants to drop in a pool table, you've got the room to do that as well. These folks chose to add the accessory suite. Pardon me. Movable island, kitchen, dishwasher, sorry, sink, dishwasher, stove, lots of room here. One thing I want to make mention, the owner had the foresight. <clears throat> He's already had a gas line run. You see this venting up at the top. This is already plumbed in. Everything is ready to go to have another gas fireplace inserted. The gas line is there. The venting goes up through the floor system out to a direct vent on the back side of the house. Really nicely done. Let's take a quick look. We'll shift over to the four piece bath in the lower level. 
This one happens to be a fiberglass surround, rectangular tile floors, And why not? We'll go take a look at the bedroom real quick. Again, lots of natural light. You've got three oversized windows. Those were all cut down to make larger through the renovations as well. Double door closet. Okay, one thing we need to talk about is ceiling height. A lot of basements, they have all, all of these features, which is fantastic, but they still feel kind of tight. This one, when I stood in the lower level, I could actually stand uh, outside of the ductwork. I could just barely get my fingertips on the ceiling. So you're approximately eight feet of a finished ceiling height down there. Uh, below the ductwork, you're probably, if I had to guess, I did not put a tape measure on it. Under the ductwork, you're probably six and a half feet. So plenty of ceiling height. Last thing I wanna mention, you've got two entrances. So when we talk about egress, not only do you have plenty of oversized windows, you actually have two doors. This door at the top of the stairs right here takes you right out to the backyard onto the back deck. So the back deck has a sliding door off the kitchen as well as this man door off the back. And I might as well, now you know what, I'll take this back to the 3D tour. Might as well show you real quick the backyard. because we did drop the camera on the back deck. So remember I was talking earlier, 80 by 180, this lot's huge, plenty of room for a pool. The backyard actually does face north, but because you've got so much room out behind the house, you've, it's not gonna be stuck in the shade. It's, uh, it's just a fantastic setup. You do have some mature trees, nice big deck off the back for hosting and entertaining as well. All the troughs, soffit, fascia, that's all been replaced. Like I said, the insulation's been all topped up, all new windows, the wiring, the plumbing has all been refreshed as well. So this house really is a turnkey. It's absolutely gorgeous, priced at uh, 574, 900. It will be hitting the market uh, later today and uh, ready for private showings. Feel free to call me with any questions, not a problem whatsoever. Again, it's 681 Amberley Avenue in London, Ontario. My name is Nathan Brooks. 519-495-9024.